can't, you know, I can't do these, these chains anymore. You know, I just can't. You know how depressing it is to go to a town and see like another just horde of fat people stumbling out of like a cheesecake factory? <laughs> you know? Oh, they're horrific, just pressing their face up against the glass. <laughs> hey, they put cookies in that one, you know? It's like they're inventing ways to get extra fat, you know? You know what I like? You know what I hate about these, these, these corporate chains? You, you, you go in there, you're paying for a business. They make you like do half the job now. I don't get it. Like I walk in, hey, let me get a uh, turkey sandwich, lettuce, tomato, and rye with mayonnaise. The guy behind the counter is like, all right, turkey sandwich, lettuce, tomato, and rye. Yeah, and, uh, and mayonnaise. <laughs> oh, the mayonnaise is, uh, it's right over there. <laughs> really? Why don't you, uh, go over there, <laughs> put it on my sandwich. You get it? I'm on this side of the register. <laughs> guy who orders the sandwich, guy who makes the sandwich. You get it? I'm sorry they fired the mayonnaise guy, but I'm not doing it. I just gave you 100% of the money to make 100% of the sandwich. This isn't like a relay race. You make half the sandwich, then you hand it off to me. I run over, I throw a pickle on it, frisbee it over to my mom. She sticks an olive with a toothpick in it. Do you recognize me? It's because I don't fucking work here, all right? Just make the sandwich. I'm out. I'm out. I gave you the money. I'm out. It's over. That's the end. That's the end of my part. No, I asked the guy for a drink. He gave me a cup. I finally go, you know what? Let me just get this whole thing to go. And the guy's like, all right, the to-go lids, they're right over there. He just snapped the lid on top. I just wanted to grab this guy by his throat and get, where is it? Where is it? Where's who? The guy making me do all this extra shit. Where is it? I just choked my way up that corporate ladder. Till I get to that eyes wide shut party and everybody's sitting there getting blown. Right? And I come, I just kick the door open. And the second they see my angry face in that lid, I didn't have to explain myself. Just put it over somebody's face and just start. How big your yacht gotta be? No, that's the thing, it's like never enough. It's never enough with those guys. You know what I can't stand now? Is when you, uh, Get that out of the way for the taping. <laughs> Cannot have that here for taping. <laughs> Cannot have a bottle cap. Let me put that down there. <laughs> what if I slip and fell 17 minutes into my set? Then what happens, huh? All goes off the rails. Now it's not a special. <laughs> <laughs> no, you know what I like? It was when you go into these places, right? Even when they're getting your money, like, th th that's not enough for them. They, they want to suck, like, more information out of you. When I bought toiletries the other day, they asked me for, like, my phone number. I'm bringing it up. They go, hey, can we have your phone number? <laughs> no. <laughs> well, Siri, we're not going to do anything with it. <laughs> really? You're just collecting numbers just for the f*** of it, you idiot? <laughs> no, you can't have my phone number. Then they get, like, all freaked out, right? Well, Siri, I, I have to put something in. If I don't, if I don't input something in, I can't get to the next... What, what, what do I do? Well, lean on the keyboard, sweetheart. I don't know what to tell you. Stick your finger on the one. There you go. That's my phone number. One of you guys That's it. Live in area code one two three. Very exclusive neighborhood. Oh, it's the worst. You have our little savey save lucky card. No, no, I know. Would you like one? No, I wouldn't. Well, why not? Because you're up to something. I don't know what you're up to, but I know you don't want to make less money, all right? Stop f***ing with me. Just ring this up and let me get on with my life. <laughs> Evidently, what you're doing is you're giving them a free survey on what products you can't live without so they can jack the price of that up under the guise of giving you like a nickel off of like bootleg Fruit Loops. <laughs> That's basically... I read it on the internet. It's got to be true, right? It's got to be.